Well, hey everybody. I've got something I want to show you all that I think is pretty cool. And this has been on my tractor for a while now, but I haven't had access to use it. I finally got everything figured out and set up, requested access to to log in or connect to the device. And I'm going to share with you all what it does. So it's this connective link um, that's mounted back here on my roll bar. If you've got a newer John Deere utility tractor, you may have one of these. It's a John JD link. And um, I'm going to show you what it does. When I originally bought this tractor, it didn't have that link on it. When, they, when John Deere took it and... Uh, did the fueling update on it. They added this device. Um, I think all the newer tractors that's coming out now, um, the 5e tractors has those on them. And that way they could monitor the tractor while I had it using it. And um, <coughs> so I got set up to where now I can monitor the tractor. So, got a couple of apps here. Um, one is the Ops Center for John Deere. So I can go into the Ops Center and select my tractor once I, once you've got it registered and, and everything and connected to your phone. So, I can bring it up and it will show on the map, on the GPS, where the tractor is located. Just to add to a little bit of, on this um, JD link, it's a little different when you're looking at it on the uh, on a computer. It's it on your phone, or a little easier to use, I guess. But um, let me show you real quick here a few little features on it. I don't know how much y'all can see. I don't know how to do this screen recording and all that stuff, but um, maybe you can kind of tell what's going on. But you got a map, and um, it's like this was today. And you can see where I've been. Um, been over here working on a driveway. Um, you can tell I went down in Anthony's field here and got some scoops of manure and then um, you can see where I went in at mom and dad's and took them down to their house and back out and you can tell which way I went in and out and that type of thing um, you can go back to different dates and look at this information um, where you've been and that type of thing you can also you got a measurement tool and you can click on it and you can kind of plot uh, an area um, kind of trace out a field and it'll show you the acreage that's in it over here on the side um, I don't know if y'all can make any of that out but over here, I worked today five hours. The tractor ran five hours and 31 minutes. Um, you can tell the time frame it was ran in. Used 5.8 gallons of fuel. You can go to view all data. Shows my fuel tank levels at 52%. And um, shows the average hydraulic oil temperature for today. 106 degrees, the average coolant temperature 175 degrees, the max is 186, um, average engine RPM speed, average fuel rate at uh, working, what I was doing today is using 1.13 gallon an hour. When I was a transport, like running on the road, um, to and from, 1.97 gallons per hour. Uh, shows your average ground speed, that type of thing. Shows how long it was in four-wheel drive. Shows if the, uh, the diff lock was used. A lot of 
a PTO, that type of thing. There's a lot of features in here that anybody could learn to use. The tractor's got 380 hours now. Um, pretty neat, actually, I think. Um, you can go to the John Deere Equip app and it you can it'll show you your scheduled maintenance plans at certain hours and that type of thing um like it shows on there right now 375 hours and 92 percent uh fuel capacity i can go to view software updates And it'll come up and show me whether the tractor has any software updates on it or not. Right now it does not. And um, I don't know if you can update your software remotely or if you'd have to take it in. But at least you would know that the software updates are available because there were some on this tractor um, updates that had been done or needed to be done. But I just wanted to share that with you. I, I, I felt like that was a pretty neat um, feature. I can go in here too. I can I can um, do a trouble code look out look up. So if I get a code, I can type it in right there, and it'll tell me what that um, code is related to. I can view parts diagrams, order parts, and everything from this app. But. Uh, I don't know that any other tractor brands have that. If they do, on this size tractor, on a, on the utility size tractor, if they do, let me know. Um, but if not, also let me know what you uh, think as far as what's available to view in there and um, if you see a neat feature to have. I think that device adds a pretty good amount of cost to it. I didn't have to pay for it. It was put on as part of the, the testing process for that fueling update but um pretty glad it's on there now but anyways appreciate y'all watching wanted to share that with you and let you know that's available and uh we will talk to you later have a good one